Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here one trailer at a time. Today, we're going to take a look at a 2025 Grand Design Transcend model number 22RBX. It's a rear bath, separate front bedroom with a side slide, weighing 5,700 pounds. Whole lot going for it here. This is the Gordy Howe of trailers. And here's my friend, that Dutch bad boy, Brennan Hanemeyer, on the camera today. Brennan? What's going on, happy campers, future campers, and fellow salespeople? Thank you so much for tuning into the number one RV YouTube channel in the world. Please don't look that up. If you don't mind hitting that like and subscribe button, that'd be greatly appreciated. When I walked inside this trailer, I went, wow. It's gorgeous inside there. You're gonna really appreciate this unit. We're on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, and Pinterest as well. Just follow us along, enjoy. Right on B, we have our front power jack, 20 pumper paint tanks, battery in a box location in behind there, wood frame, aluminum skin on these transcends. We have our pass-through storage from one side to the other. It looks like for 2025, they're including an outside table. What a bonus. What a bonus, bro. Getting the best made trailer in the market and getting a table. And getting a table. Can't vouch for the quality of the table though, can we? Oh no. The Grand Design's probably not making that table. No, they're probably not making that table. <laughs> City water connection, fresh water fill, battery disconnect and solar disconnect, an outside receptacle and cable and satellite inlet. Now you gotta be careful on these because the Transcend Explorer, the solar is not standard. This one has it, but it's not a standard feature. Four manual stabilizer jacks. Our secondary sewer drain is in through here. We got our black rims, but chrome don't get you home. What kind of, uh, or sorry, what house, what size of tires? 15s, these? buddy. Our 15s in through there. A rack and pinion style slide. Rack and pinion, baby. Main sewer drain there. 30 amp detachable style cord. And then here at the back, we have our full size spare outside spray port and then our black water flush kit here at the back because our washroom's at the back brennan good we're prepped up there for a backup camera we're prepped up there for a ladder get up on your roof check your seals every 90 days that's a one-piece roof which is how i like my grandmother's bathing suits one big bonus to the 22 rbx over top of the old 20 the 221 rb is we get an outside kitchen so check this out two cubic foot electric fridge. We've also got this fancy little griddle that's gonna slide out in through here. We're literally cooking with gas. We have another receptacle here. So maybe you put that tabletop here, Brennan, get the ice maker going, get the slush maker going, smoke machine going for the campsite. That's, does that slide out more? It does slide out more. Is that far enough? Does this not? No. Uh, what do you want to slide out more? You just want this to slide? Just can slide, so I'm just showing it oh, off. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> so it slides out more. <laughs> yeah. While we're at it now, Brennan. Flip her around. Just imagine that, right? We got all this space, just put extra stuff. No, you're right. All your tools and stuff like that can go in through there. Your drills, uh, <laughs> saws. No, your spatula. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> I got you, buddy. Um, bingo, bango. Pretty slick little outside kitchen. I love the fact that it's finished off with galvanil. Our electric awning starts here, goes the rest of the way forward. LED lights built into that awning, secure step down below, leash latching through there too. Our gravity fill, freshwater fill, kitchen window, outside JBL sound system. Uh, there's also an outside, uh, sorry, an inside JBL speaker as well. Uh, range hood vent, six gallon gas electric water heater, furnace vent, outside receptacle. And then right here is just the other side of our pass through storage. Now, travel access is okay. Right, we can't get to the bedroom. We're getting a two out of three. Yep. We're easily getting to our bathroom. Whew. And then we're sliding down here into our kitchen. It's a French door fridge. We'll look at this closer, but we can get to the left-hand side of the fridge quite easily and then get the right-hand side just a little bit open. Let's get this guy opened up. Right on folks, we're inside that 22RBX. You're standing in the bedroom there, looking back into our living space. This one's got the theater seat option, Brennan. I love that. Yeah, you prefer that to the U? I think so. I think so too. Uh, although I can see the benefit and get that secondary sleeping option out of the U-shaped dinette, right? So- Can you lay is, down on this? Would you like me to? Please. Just curious. So I'm a pretty big dude. Well, you're six feet tall. Yeah, so uh, slightly above average, doesn't matter. Grandkids sleeping on there. Yeah, no, you're right. 
like grandkids are sleeping on here comfortably. It's flat, like it's not like it's really bumpy in the center there. Uh, we do have the electric reclining action in through here, which is pretty slick if you ask me. It's a flush floor slide. Uh, with no carpet in the slide, which is nice. We have these big windows here in the slide too. And then I I always love this big sliding door, Brent. I gotta do a better job of showing this off more. Just blocking off the bathroom there from the living space. Really, really nice big door, big entrance to get into that bathroom. So it's not like you're going through like a cave. Over here, we have our kitchen countertop. It's countertop for days here, right? There's so much kitchen countertop. We got cupboard here covered there a little bit of a doggy dish here down below those are removable if you want to use that for storage covered space there and a cutlery drawer here we have our three burner stove top drawers down below that and then another drawer here that pulls out our garbage can just a great use of space and then a little skinny cupboard in through there for baking sheets or whatever you want to do we have seamless counters undermount stainless steel sink pull out faucet Cupboards here across the top, even though this is Grand Design's like, you know, entry level brand, we still got shelves in through here. I love that. Open storage here for cereal box. This is gonna be our microwave, cupboard space here, and then a spot right here where you can put a TV. Your hookups are all there with our door side kitchen window, two receptacles in the kitchen, fantastic stuff. Now heading into the bathroom, we have a plastic sink, or sorry, pl well, plastic sink and a plastic toilet. Dump truck fits. Little bit of shelf here for squeegees, cupboard there, all kinds of counter space, shelf, 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 medicine cabinet there, and then a window at the back. Linen closet down the left hand side. I'm six feet tall. You can see I fit in the shower quite easily. Pretty decent shower. Hey? Tons of space. Tons of space in through there. And then coming out of the bathroom, moving forward, we got this brand new fridge. What did we say this fridge was? 10.3? Yeah. 12 volt fridge there, running off the battery, battery being charged off the optional solar panel we got on this guy. And I love this drawer here. Just for freezer and stuff like that, fantastic. I guess not for stuff like that, just for freezer. And then how about these recessed lights we got here, eh? I don't know if it's hard to pick up in the camera, but it's just nice and flush with the roof. Big, big fan of the recessed lighting we have in the main salon. Window on either side of the bed, Full size 60 by 80 inch queen hanging on the one side, and I'm pretty sure we're gonna have shelving over here on the right hand side. Bingo bango. Open storage here across the top. Cubby holes on either side with USBs and rece receptacles. And then right here, we're gonna have storage underneath the bed. Fantastic stuff, AB. Eh, yep, and if you wanna eat inside, you just grab that table in the faster storage and set it up in front of the chairs. Bingo bango, baby. That's the video, folks. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok. Leave us a comment down below. Have yourself a good day.